NV55C, the first generation of i5. The model is 460M processor. This one uses the Intel HD graphic 5700 support before. And thanks to uh, InsanelyMag.com and Ghost Rider, uh, we got this one running full functional. I got my uh, external hard drive working. So now I want to restore it to the dual boot. I want this utility. So I'm going to drag it to here so I don't have to do it later. Seven. I installed Lion 10.73 before a long time ago. Um, so, so let's look at um, this partition. It's master boot record. So all the old laptop they use master boot record, not like the new one now. They use um, EFI or UEFI, which is. Um, GUID partition table. Alright. So this one's actually is dual boot right now with Lion uh, using uh, Easy BCD. So actually that's pretty good uh, little program there. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna back up this 10.9.2 that's fully working with uh, with this laptop first generation uh, i5 460m networks is working that's all I care about all right uh, the ethernet is not hooked up but it does work also so I hook it up right now and see if it's gonna come up oh, it's not full you cannot record uh, screen recording right now anyway so it has to be display trackpad sound yeah if sound doesn't work you're not hearing me iCloud is working alright I create a new um, account so iCloud is working built-in is true so it should be working. Alright, EN1, which is a theorem. Build this is false, but it doesn't matter. Two Lion. Okay? 52 gig. So what it's gonna do is option this is a free version so you can't do much with it but that's what all I care about is to actually back up something and um, and restore so here's what we're going to do restore ready to copy all right. So after it's copy, it will make Lion 10.73 bootable. All right. Okay. So it's gonna take a while because the copy speed on this one is about 15 meg per second. 20. That's pretty good. When we back up with uh, super duper window uh, easy BCD still working but the only problem is that when we boot into the lion I mean actually it's a, a Mavericks already after the super duper um, we get chain booting error so we need to fix this. 
So in order to fix right, this, click F12 and boot from um, the external hard drive. And now we're going to boot into our gateway. Okay. Up 10.9.2. So we use Camellia. Okay, so we use uh, the external um, Camellia bootloader to load, to boot in our newly restored partition. Okay. So now we're going to need to install Camellia. Is it continue? Continue? Continue to breathe. Oh, it's done. fix anything. Perfect. Isn't that nice? Alright, uh, let's look at the um, the extra folder for the first generation HD 5700 um, this is i5-460M now the module uh, we don't really need the um, kernel patcher so they don't have the lattic um, problem. So the extension, uh, we don't have much in here. Okay, so the boot. So very simple. It doesn't have all of these uh, device property or anything like that. Uh, we need to put in here. 